Hello, and welcome back to Lux Landmarks. We had a lot of fun putting together our last list of the most expensive houses in the world and worked to create an even more jaw-dropping part two. This time, we're covering houses that are even more expensive and even more lavish from countries all over the world. Starting at $12 million all the way up to a staggering $750 million, let's begin at the bottom of the list. Number 10, Clifton Tuwe in sunny Cape Town, South Africa. Located atop a cliff in the beautiful city of Cape Town, the designers at SAOTA crafted this contemporary family residence overlooking a breathtaking coastline. To create a spacious living room, the architects elevated the main level consisting of the guest room, gym, study, and garage. The ground floor is set partially into the steep site, maximizing the living space and isolating it from the noisy provincial roads. The first and second floors are set back and rotated to create a protective aesthetic over the external terrace. The family room, kitchen, dining area, and lounge flow seamlessly onto the centrally positioned external terrace. This elevated terrace enjoys shelter from the carefully rotated bedroom wings while optimizing the magnificent views. A glass bridge connects the upper levels. This allows sunlight to filter between the bedroom wings and illuminate the central areas on the south side of the house. The whole residence is positioned below Lion's Head Mountain, with a stunning view of the Atlantic Ocean, Camps Bay, and the Twelve Apostles beyond. Number 9. Jungle House in Sao Paulo, Brazil Tucked into the jungle, near the historic town of Parachi, the secluded 52-acre waterfront property has a private helipad and a medicinal garden. The 52-acre property, known as Casa Santa Rita, listed for $15 million. It's ensconced in the lush Brazilian jungle and can only be accessed by helicopter or boat. It was designed by renowned Brazilian architect Marcio Kogan, who sought to create a fully self-sufficient house that draws upon its natural surroundings. The property is built within the hillside and showcases how modern architecture and nature can harmoniously coexist. The main level houses a vast, open-plan living room, which is lined with gigantic floor-to-ceiling windows that slide open to a spacious terrace. A floating staircase leads to the upper level, where there are five bedrooms purposefully placed to shelter each room from the hot Brazilian sun. In addition to world-class architecture, the house has a ton of amenities. Below the house is a spacious teak deck and a 1,000-square-foot infinity-edge pool and spa overlooking 280 feet of private beach frontage. There is also a state-of-the-art oceanfront fitness center and a game room. For culinary pursuits, there's a summer kitchen, as well as an ice cream maker, a pizza oven, and a 1,000-bottle wine cellar. Number 8. Sky Garden House in Singapore while it may be cooling down here in the USA, can you imagine how incredible spring would feel in a country where the city is literally inside of a garden? That's what it's like in glorious Singapore. This country is the epitome of all things green and gorgeous, and we have found a house that has been designed with that in mind too, Sky Garden House. This gorgeous house is located in a new housing estate on Sentosa Island, Designed by Goose Architects, the home features gorgeous layers of rooftop gardens, giving each story both physical and visual access to the greenery, whilst taking advantage of the small block size on the island. The house not only has beautiful layers on the exterior, the layering effect is also brought inside as you walk from level to level via its stunning staircases. The home also features the most breathtaking pool that you can enjoy both outside and inside via the large glass window. Designed to embrace the country's city in a garden mantra, but also highlight how tranquil and inspired by nature modern architecture can be, this property is truly a delight to ogle at and would be a dream to live in. I mean, living on a gorgeous island surrounded by amazing fun activities like Universal Studios, Adventure Cove Water Park, Sentosa Golf Club, and magnificent beaches, were sold. Number 7. Cherry Hill in Wentworth Estate, United Kingdom This example of British modernist architecture and the former country estate of U.S. Ambassador John Hay Whitney represents a unique restoration of one of the Wentworth Estate's most historic homes. 
built in the 1930s by the visionary British architect Oliver Hill and now beautifully restored. Cherry Hill sits in four plus acres in a secluded and private position. The house was designed to wrap around two Scots pines trees and envelop the inhabitants with natural light throughout the day. Upon arrival, you were met by a grand sculptural staircase wrapped by a curved double height glass structure. It's not until you're inside the house that you fully appreciate the masterpiece that's been created. The painstakingly restored building has recently been bracketed by two elegant pavilions to provide all the expected amenities of modern life, such as a discreet indoor swimming pool, a cinema, a wine cellar, and a separate utility wing. To give further unity to the whole, and in keeping with Oliver Hill's passion for interior design, rare types of Italian marble, granite, as well as lavish panels of exotic woods, have been carefully selected to enhance the play of light on all surfaces of its interior and exterior. Number 6. Stevio in Queenstown, New Zealand Known as Stevio, after the Italian mountain pass and ski course, the 880 cubic meters Queenstown Hill home is on the market for $35 million. The house sits in a gated community above the town and features six bedrooms, six bathrooms, three living spaces, and six car garaging over three levels. Building materials range from locally sourced stone to exquisite solid oak walls. It also features an exquisite crystal chandelier in the entranceway one of only two of its kind. The other hangs in luxury design house Hermes in Paris. Designed by architects Mason and Wales, the house was completed in 2015 and won several building and architectural awards. Number five, Cornwall Gardens in Singapore. Featuring a swimming pool, waterfall, koi carp pond, and a terraced roof garden, this large family house in Singapore was another of the winners in Erkatizer's 2016 a Awards. Designed by Singapore Studio Chong Architects, the house was created to accommodate a multi-generation family with space for future additions, if the children marry. Six bedrooms, a gym, entertainment spaces, a library, and multiple dining areas are arranged around a central courtyard with a swimming pool. There's also a waterfall and pond at basement level. Plants feature heavily throughout the building, with a green courtyard, entrance foyer, window box-like structures, and an expansive roof garden. Built on a sloping plot, the structure is a redevelopment of an existing house that previously occupied the site. Chong Architects designed the new house to almost completely fill the plot, with most living spaces opening onto the internal courtyard. Each level above the basement features a ring of planting around the pool courtyard. Trellises and training cables are provided for plants to grow along, eventually creating screens for the full height windows. Number 4. Billionaire in Bel Air Road, USA What's in a name? Not much apparently for Billionaire, the moniker of this Bel Air mansion. The house just recently sold for $94 million, a 62% markdown from its 2017 asking price $250 million that made it the most expensive home in the USA at the time. The mansion is a stunning 38,000 square feet elite luxury residence with 17,000 square feet of entertainment decks encapsulating an astonishing array of amenities and bespoke items from around the world. Meticulously curated over four floors, this house delivers an unimaginable indoor-outdoor nirvana, enhanced by unobstructed 270-degree views spanning from the mountains all the way to the ocean and across the incredible Los Angeles skyline in between. Located in the confines of ultra-exclusive Bel Air Enclave, this triumphant marvel includes two master suites, 10 oversized VIP guest suites, 21 luxury bathrooms, three gourmet kitchens, five bars, a massage studio and wellness spa, state-of-the-art fitness center, 85-foot glass tile infinity swimming pool, 40-seat 4K Dolby Atmos theater, four-lane bowling alley, sprawling auto gallery with cars valued at more than $30 million, seven-person full-time staff, over 100 curated art installations, an outdoor hydraulic pop-up theater, Theater, two fully stocked champagne wine cellars, massive assorted candy wall, and the most advanced home tech system in the country. Now that's a mouthful and a half. Number 3. Ellison Estate, USA 
Larry Ellison doesn't just own one property, but his Japanese-style Ellison estate might just be the most impressive. Located in Woodside, California, this incredible waterfront property is one that's definitely worthy of its never-ending attention. It's actually a collection of houses inside one giant property, alongside a man-made lake, a tea house, and a bathhouse. The six-acre property inside a gated community boasts more than 500 feet of ocean frontage in a neighborhood that includes fellow billionaires Robert Smith, David Tepper, and Steve Wynn. The 15,514-square-foot Tuscan home has seven bedrooms, 11 bathrooms, a theater, wine room, and a lawn big enough to accommodate a helicopter. It's designed to settle into its surroundings, with a lodge-style design throughout, and all of the comfy, cozy velvet sofas and fireplaces you could ever need. It's arguably the world's coolest lake house and sets the scene for a relaxing holiday. Number 2. Les Palais Bulls in France Possibly the most extravagant home on the French Riviera, the Bubble Palace is a little different from your ordinary million-dollar house. As its name suggests, this luxury property in tail sur mer near Cannes is shaped like a huge terracotta-colored bubble. A bird's-eye view at the Palais Bulls reveals a collection of circular buildings, and the circle theme continues inside. Take a walk through the Bubble Palace and you'll spot cylindrical beds, swimming pools, and artwork. The luxury villa was designed by Hungarian architect Antti Lovig and features 10 suites decorated by different contemporary artists. As well as the series of round rooms, this luxury mansion is also home to a sprawling open-air 500-seat amphitheater on the hillside grounds with views overlooking the Mediterranean Sea. The Bubble Palace was last owned by the late French fashion designer Pierre Cardin, who acquired the historic mansion in 1992 as a luxury holiday home and has been the backdrop for many a fashion and celebrity event. And since Cardin's death in 2020, the entire estate is available to rent, but not available to the public. Number 1. Villa Leopolda in France Located on the heights of Villefranche-sur-Mer, at the Cairo Pass, between Nice and Monaco and enjoying a breathtaking view of the Mediterranean, Villa Leopolda is an exceptional villa. It is one of the most expensive in the world, the third according to some estimates, $750 million or about 653 million euros, the first being Buckingham Palace and the second a house built in India in 2010. This 18-acre villa built with the unbelievable number of 12 pools throughout the estate, 19 master bedroom suites, 14 bathrooms. All of these rooms are decorated accordingly with authentic and sophisticated luxury pieces that were meant to be displayed at Villa Leopolda. Situated a few miles away from Nice, this traditional and massive villa is beautifully embellished by grand and luxury pieces and enormous terraces with the most wonderful view you can imagine. Once bought by the Italian car brand owner of Fiat and Ferrari, Giovanni Agnelli, the ample garage space will more than suit anyone's needs. Villa Leopolda also contains a magnificent and carefully kept garden with almost 8 hectares, with a variety of flora. With a total area of 400 square meters, Villa Leopolda has already starred in many famous TV shows and also in a film by Hitchcock. It was considered one of the most important estates in the history of Europe, with the most breathtaking view of the French Riviera. That ends off today's list, but we do already have a few houses kept aside for a part three. If that's something you'd be interested in, why not subscribe and join us for the next one? Assuming you've made it this far into the video, we'd greatly appreciate a like. It really helps out smaller channels like ours more than you know. We'd love to hear your thoughts on these houses or any over-the-top houses that we haven't covered today. Drop your opinions in the comments, we always reply back. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, bye for now.